can you explain how quantum is connected in our day-to-day life? Right. So how, what is the relevance of quantum physics and the quantum world in our day-to-day life? So you see the world that we live in, it emerges out of the microscopic world. The flesh and blood that we have in our bodies, the fabric we wear, the world around us, it is made up of microscopic particles. And all of these particles, these microscopic particles at the atomic and molecular and subatomic level obey the laws of quantum mechanics, quantum physics and quantum field theory. So everything, every phenomenon that we observe in the mundane day-to-day world is a phenomenon that emerges from the quantum level. Now, certain quantum phenomena are present to us, are, are observable to the naked eye. For example, if you see a crystal, a crystal of quartz, for example, the crystal structure, the crystalline structure of quartz or any other crystal is governed by the laws of quantum mechanics. So that is a quantum, it's a macroscopic quantum object that we can perceive in our daily life. If you look outside the window in the morning and look at the sun, I mean, don't look directly at it, but you see the sunlight, that sunlight comes from the sun. The sun is an enormous nuclear reaction. It's an enormous fusion reaction, which is a quantum process. And a fun fact, every photon of sunlight that emerges out of the sun takes thousands of years to emerge out of the sun, maybe millions of years, because it is absorbed and reabsorbed and emitted and reabsorbed trillions of times inside the sun before it's able to emerge out, out, of, out of the sun's uh, atmosphere. So every photon of sunlight that reaches us was born either thousands or millions of years ago inside the sun, in the interior of the sun. And it takes that much time to traverse the distance from the in- interior of the sun to outside of it. So that's a quantum phenomenon. And everything else that we observe emerges out of the quantum domain. The laws of quantum physics are not observable to us to the most part because uh, quantum phenomena either collapse or they decohere and they become classical phenomena, which is the laws of classical physics. So that is the relationship between the quantum world and the ordinary world. The ordinary world emerges out of the quantum world. And... uh, it, it, the laws of quantum physics are very non-intuitive. They are very strange. And the paradox is that they give rise to the laws of physics that we know and the, which seem so ordinary to us, except the law of gravity, which we still don't understand. So that is how the ordinary world emerges out of the quantum world. That is the relationship. There is a direct relationship between the quantum world and our day-to-day world.